what happens if one suffers from myopic or hypermetropic vision, blurred sights that impede your visual delights. But no need to look any further for a solution. In this high-tech age, fueled by computer chips, even the eye has gone the e-way. It wasn't long ago when the entire process of eye testing and treatment was done manually. There was always a lurking fear of miscalculations that could cause only further damage to your windows to the world. But computerized eye testing has cast away all such fears today. Earlier we would have problems, say, we have glaucoma. We want to chart out the fields of a glaucoma patient which a little difference also can make a great difference in prognosis of the patient, in the treatment of the patient. So we needed equipment which gives us a precise field charting and that's where computers held us a lot. We have computer assisted perimetry where we come to know exact amount of field loss or what is the depth loss in that field. So that's one area. Computers have uh, revolutionized not only the investigation, the diagnosis part, but also the treatment part in ophthalmology. The field of eye testing today is witness to numerous state-of-the-art computerized devices. One such device, the auto-reflectometer, gives full information on eye condition in just a few minutes. Yet another device used by opticians is the Obsian. Through this, the exact calculations pertaining to the cornea can be easily ascertained without any manual intervention. What's more, the Fossimeter. Another device deduces the power that your spectacles require. Auto refractometer. This gives us an indication of the prescription of the client within a few seconds. Of course, we have to manually check it. But the spherical, the cylinder, the excess, we can know within a few seconds what is the prescription of this. Then we have this scan. This is called the op scan without touching the patient's eye without coming in contact with the eye it's like taking a photograph or like taking an x-ray of the eye we have all the parameters the topography the pachymetry the thickness of the eye the all the pupil diameter the corneal diameter within a few seconds on the flip of a button we have this. computers also play a vital role in eye surgery Operations conducted using lasers are not only quick, but extremely accurate. We have excimer lasers, top of the line excimer lasers, in which the computer decides how much of chiseling for the cornea has to be done, guides the machine to do the chiseling and carries it out. The doctor usually just stands by and that is the importance of computers in ophthalmology. The operation which we do for removal of glasses by excimer laser is 99% done by the computer which are developed. In fact, after gauging the exact power that your lens requires, even the entire process of making your spectacles has been made much simpler. The auto edger performs all the steps right from glass cutting to fitting in a matter of minutes. However, some eye specialists are of the view that such high-tech devices have their own kind of limitations. In fact, manual techniques have their own advantages. But in the final analysis, what is called for is utmost care on the part of eye specialists. is given by the computer is not necessarily the one which is the patient is going to accept. So acceptance of the patient is much more important than the acuity number given by the computer. So many times you find a disparity between the number and the, the acceptance of the patient. So we always go by the choice of the patient. Whatever the person, the patient accepts is the number given to him. So especially I would uh, warn my viewers that when they're going for the glasses, the number of their uh, glasses, they must wear the number get used to it and then only tell the doctor yes they're comfortable with it just because the number has come out of a computer computer generated number does not make it the best number for the person undoubtedly the entry of computers have made the field of eye testing and treatment much simpler 
Not only do they save time, but also guarantee foolproof results. Today, the search for new and better devices is still on. And possibly, in the days to come, we might just witness the arrival of an all-purpose device that tests, diagnoses and manufactures your most indispensable optical companion in a matter of minutes. Till then, let's be satisfied with the present state of affairs, shall we?